Tonight, the search continues for two inmates on the run after escaping from the Jefferson County Jail. Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us for Fox 16 News at 9. I'm Donna Terrell. The sheriff's office says Wesley Gullett and Christopher Sanderson were being housed at the jail on a hold for U.S. Marshals regarding a large federal indictment. Fox 16's Rochelle Turner takes a closer look at how they got away. Rochelle. Well, Donna, good evening to you. This isn't the first time inmates have tried to break out, of, break out of jail. Just a few days ago, Sheriff Lafayette Wood says two other inmates breached the jail but never actually made it out. Now Woods is taking swift action, beefing up security measures at the jail, but he adds this isn't a quick fix. Now Woods says Gullet and Sanderson, the two men you see on your screen, were able to detect vulnerabilities in the jail and exploited that, ultimately breaking out. Wood says this happened sometime between Tuesday morning and Wednesday morning. Gullet is one of 54 members of a white supremacist gang known as the New Aryan Empire who have been indicted on federal charges. Sheriff Wood also says Gullet and Sanderson knew each other from the outside. The pair were housed in a pod that holds 17 inmates. It was checked twice on Tuesday, but after noticing the two were missing, all deputies found were a dummy. The three checks are supposed to be done uh, throughout the day. Uh, that check and count was off, obviously. And I'm going to be honest with you, uh, it comes back down to uh, complacency. It comes down to just being lazy uh, and not paying attention to what we're doing. And so at that point, we're handling that internally with our staff. If you're not physically putting hands on somebody and the count is off, you know, that's an issue. Sheriff Wood says in order to minimize the threat of this happening again, they're going to be adding additional fences, wires, and cameras. And Wood says he doesn't believe the two had help from the inside, but there is an internal investigation underway. Official, officials don't believe the two inmates are still in Jefferson County at this point. What else is Sheriff Wood saying about the investigation? And I'm curious, Rochelle, how many guards actually work on that pod? Right now, he's saying that there's a lot of stuff that he just couldn't answer because mm -hmm. it is under investigation. However, he did say that there were four deputy jailers that and some uh, of the supervisors that are being questioned right now. And mm -hmm. he said all that is just going to have to, it's going to take some time with this one. But their biggest goal is to try to get these two guys back into the jail. Immediately. All right. Thank you. Thank you.